Hey, what's up guys? Guru Tech Support here with another video. Today we're taking a look at something rather interesting. Uh, Apple Pay at the gas pump. A Circle K, about five minutes from my house, decided to put a new pump station in on all of their pumps, actually, and added contactless readers as well. Um, I dropped back down there a couple of days after I noticed them replacing the pumps and gave it a shot. I tried a contactless MasterCard in Apple Pay first and had no problems, went right through. I did have to put in my zip code, um, and it worked just fine. I'm blurring out the zip code here, as you can see. I um, was able to select my grade, pump the gas, no, no problems. Next up, I tried a contactless MasterCard in Samsung Pay with my Gear S3 Frontier. Same story, no problems. I entered a incorrect zip code this time. I put in 0000, 000, 000, 000 <laughs> and it also worked fine. So that shows they're not actually checking a zip code. Not terribly surprising. That does that usually happen with most gas pumps. They don't usually check against the card information if the zip code is correct. It's usually a false sense of security. Um, but yeah, it worked fine as well. And then finally, I also tried a MasterCard debit card ran as debit on the Gear S3 and Samsung Pay, and it worked just as fine. Uh, entered the pin, went right through, no problems at all. Um, very exciting this is implemented. This is the first station in the area, um, as far as I could tell, that actually has this working. Uh, none of the other stations in the entire area of where I live actually has this at all. I've looked everywhere and have yet to find one except for right here. Uh, I'd like to see this more widely rolled out as it would greatly help with the card fraud in the prepay pump areas. And it's honestly really convenient, and it's kind of cool. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video, guys. I have another video coming out here in the next couple of days. It'll showcase Samsung Pay at a few other places in my area. And then also I've got another video coming out very shortly that will cover something a little bit different than we normally do. Uh, it's a HD DVD and Blu-ray comparison video and kind of the story of HD DVD and what it was. If you want to check that out, I'll link it in the description once the video's up. Uh, for now, feel free to enjoy my other videos, and I hope you guys have a good one. Thanks for watching.